morning. I'm a German citizen and I'm currently living in Georgia. And today I want to share some concerns I have with you. We're facing serious environmental changes due to our excessive energy consumption. And I'm focusing here only on climate change. Superstorms, fires, 100 year floods every decade. This is happening in rich countries and countries that have the ability to support the victims to get back on their feet, at least to a certain extent. But these extreme weather conditions, these extreme events happen all over the globe in societies that struggle already under normal environmental conditions. And I'd like to know what should be our first priority? Ensuring the livelihoods of all people on this planet or ensuring the growing energy demand on the industrialized part of the world? And what means growing energy demand? I always hear this phrase, growing energy demand, as if it's something, some, um, a matter of fact. Growing economy means growing uh, energy demand, and that means, consequently, growing waste, growing pollution, growing inequity, in inequity and so on. Any thinking person should notice that we need to find a way out. For anyone concerned about our future, business as usual is not longer acceptable. We need drastic changes in our energy supply. We need to use less. I want to call on your responsibility to regulate Georgia Power. Instead of rubber stamping Georgia Power's business as usual, you should make them commit to energy efficiency and support consumers in using less energy and thereby paying less. After tapping the full potential of efficiency and conservation, the electricity that is still needed has to come from renewable resources. In Germany, the energy transformation to sustainable sources is driven by distributed energy supply and not by the monopolists. And this, as we all know, has a lot of positive side effects like more jobs, more autonomy to local communities, cleaner air and water, and local added value. It is not enough to add a little solar and wind, also that's a start, but it's not enough to add these things on top of the old extractive energy sources as fossil and fission fuels. Georgia has a long way to go, and it needs fundamental changes now. We cannot afford to wait another 20 years, and it is possible with a serious effort we can save up to 30% of electricity within the next 20 years. 20 years to focus on developing clean solutions, and I mean clean solutions and not nuclear. And talking about nuclear, additionally to the 20 years plan to meet electricity demand, I would like to see from Georgia Power a one million year plan to safely store the radioactive waste that they are producing. Thank you. Thank you.